Iran claims it has captured one of America's most sophisticated spy planes. U.S. intelligence is spying intensely on Iranian sites believed to be developing nuclear weapons and long-range missiles. Bob Orr tells us an unmanned U.S. drone did vanish over the weekend. The secret stealth drone, nicknamed the Beast of Kandahar, is one of America's most sophisticated intelligence tools. For the past four years, the RQ-170 has flown high-altitude surveillance missions over the battlefields in Afghanistan and its border with Pakistan. On the night of the bin Laden raid, one of the radar evading unmanned aircraft monitored the Navy SEAL's assault. But now U.S. officials say it's extremely likely one of the bat-shaped drones has fallen into the hands of the Iranian government. And weapons expert Joseph Serencioni says that could prove costly. If the Iranians and others were to get access to the stealth technology, to the advanced electronics in that drone, it could seriously set back U.S. national security interests. U.S. officials dispute Iranian claims the drone was shot down or commandeered by a cyber attack. But NATO admitted a drone was lost late last week as it flew near the Afghanistan-Iran border. Iran claims the aircraft is relatively intact with minor damage, but so far the Iranians have not produced pictures to prove it. The U.S. will not comment on the mission, but some analysts believe the drone was spying on Iran's nuclear program. What kinds of things would, would a vehicle like this be looking for in Iran? You're looking to understand better what the Iranians are building, what kind of capabilities they have. It's not clear how much of the drone Iran has or whether the wreckage will reveal any secrets. It's possible the drone was equipped with self-destruct devices aimed at destroying sensitive technology, but Scott, frankly, the systems are classified, so we don't know. Bob, thank you very much. We have some unclassified satellite pictures tonight of what appears to be a major setback for the Iranian missile program. This is a photo of a testing site for solid rockets. There's concern that Iran is developing missiles to carry a future nuclear weapon. Well, this is a new picture of the plant after an explosion three weeks ago. Not only were the buildings destroyed, the head of the missile program was killed. Iran says it was an accident. No government has claimed responsibility for any attack.